I'm Joe, I'm 25 years of age. Um, I first started in the industry nine and a half years ago as a plumbing apprentice. From when I first started at 16, I just wanted to make sure whatever I did, that I wanted to be the best at that. I was three years into my apprenticeship in plumbing and they actually made me to a sort of charge hand position. So I had my first bit of responsibility at 18. I used to go up to the plumbers and the plumbers used to say to me, Joe, you ask far too many questions. I used to take the drawings home with me because if there was something I didn't understand that day, I'd take it home with me, study it overnight. Then the phone call come on, can Joe come in the office because we want to give him an opportunity. My third year of my apprenticeship for plumbing, I got the apprentice of the year and that was a massive achievement for me. At the age of 20 to 22, I've done a HNC and I've been doing my degree at London South Bank for four years, doing a B-Eng in Building Services Engineering. I didn't really believe academically I was going to be that person that was going to go off to university. I never would have dreamed it. An interesting project that I'm working on at the moment at university is a dissertation project. With the trombe wall, they use it in hot climate or a thin wall structure to heat up a space and effectively you get free heating through the wall void. So we're using natural means to provide natural ventilation coming through the apartment to basically save energy, but more importantly, improve human comfort. Once my degree's finished, um, I've already applied. So I've applied for four to five universities to do a master's degree. One person that's been great for my development is uh, Clive Carr. What Joe does is, is good with people, he engages, he shows a huge commitment uh, and just to understand what we need to do to work well with our client to deliver their outcome. Joe shows the skills and attributes that do support that approach. We're here at Stratford building S5 uh, as part of the IQL development. Um, this is a 20 floor office commercial building for us. Um, I'm the mechanical engineer on this job. I'm really quite lucky. I've come through the tours and I've had a craft apprenticeship for four years, but I've also had a technical apprenticeship for another four years, so I've had the best of both. I've done time in estimating, I've spent time in procurement, spent time in design, I've done surveying, so I feel I've learned different aspects to my game. It's nice to actually look at something that you can put your stamp on and be proud of. T Clark's an amazing learning environment. Prestigious projects like this one. People around you who have so much experience. Teams on site who are absolute experts at buildability. For me, it's all about learning new technologies, old technologies with new applications on site, in the classroom, learning from lecturers, learning from operators on site, learning from others and sharing what I've learned. So this is Brett, he's one of our T Clark apprentices that I'm currently mentoring. So the information and all the knowledge that I learned from previous years, I get to then pass on down to Brett. Yeah, everything he's sort of been taught over the years, he sort of, uh, he teaches me, so he just sort of, yeah, he takes me through the steps. And yeah, I'm, I'm sort of getting there now. So as you can see, over Stratford, um, this is building S5, but we're on a plot of a potential another 10 buildings. Um, and we're actually on a framework of um, further 10 years here. So you can sort of see the large scale of this project and it's, it's great to be a part of. And now my next challenge is to, to start my masters and then progress further. I'd like to work on the biggest London projects there are in the industry. I want to sort of test myself against the best um, and I want to learn from them. The reason I'm doing a masters now is you can see the industry changing digital technologies, the collaboration information and all the teams pulling together. It's all coming and I definitely want to be a part of that. Work for me is not just a job, it's my life. I take my work so seriously and it's something that I really enjoy. I'll never stop pushing myself.